Today, guys, we are going to be checking out Singular Point Anguara, seeing some battling moves, even some crazy moves from him. But first, we're going to have to play with the regular Anguarus to get his level up. Uh, let's jump right in here. First off, guys, I haven't played this game in a minute. You can see the whole screen has changed. The main menu looking amazing. We got Mecha G, Destroyer, and Godzilla. Oh, hold up. We got Anguarus down here. Main menu looking gorgeous. Also, let's go ahead and check out some missions. We got Destroy 150 Buildings. We can do that one. Click the Golden Tree in the Arctic. We know exactly where that is. And Sea Hunter kill five swimming players. That's going to be easy, too. Actually, that might be pretty difficult. Anyways, let's go ahead and search up Singular Point. There he is right there. And I'm not sure what move he's doing right now, but his scales on the back are lighting up. So let's read a little bit about him. It says, enter defense mode to take reduced damage and reflect beams and projectiles. That sounds absolutely amazing. But as you can see, we need level 25 Anguarius first. And yes, I know that's not how you say his name, but here he is right here, Anguarius. Y'all gotta help me say his name. Pronounce it in the comments. Also, you can see we only have one damage boost for him. He is not doing very much damage at all. So uh, let's go ahead and get to it. We are probably gonna have a long way to go here, but the good news is there's already some Kaijus and they are ready to battle. Oh, hold up. That is SP Anguirus right there and we're about to chop him down. All we gotta do, guys, is get to level 25 off of the bat and we will be able to get that new Kaiju. And I'm about to chop down Mr. Goji right here, man. If I can just hit him a few more times. Okay, we're dead. Hey, guys, it's been a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little rusty. Let me go ahead and hit a roar real quick. What do you got? It Barvis, um, I, I don't know about that. That was more like a screech than anything. What about Sonic Roar over... There we go. That's a lot better. And now let me go ahead and roll up on somebody like this, man. Mr. Godzilla, how you do? I don't even need to drop you off, man. I just need to fight because I need my level up. We need to get the SP version of this character. You know, the normal one, he kind of looks a little goofy. But the SP Angie, oh my goodness, he looks amazing. I, I got jumped. Oh, and by the way, guys, we have created a brand new channel. If you want to find it, just go on YouTube and type in in the search bar, Cappy Shorts, and it'll take you to the brand new Shorts channel where we already have a couple weeks of videos. And we've already got about 3K subs, so go sub and be one of the first ever OG subs on that channel. That's probably going to happen a lot in this video, but I do like the way he rolls around the map like this. You can get places pretty fast, and here we go, man. Thermo G. Don't come over here throwing hands at, you know what, I am going to throw hands. Don't hit me with the post, though, please. If anything, just leave the post out of the equation and throw some hands with me. There we go. My boy Angie over here trying his best, but you already know, guys, he is not about to beat Thermo G. We did level up to level nine, though. I see that, and we have died once again. What about Mr. Behemoth right here? He was just chilling in prom by himself. Can we at least get to level 10 off of fighting Behemoth? I don't even know if we can. Oh, yeah, hold up. I'm tripping. We definitely can get to that level 10. Angie, you keep it up, man. There we go. We have hit level 10. We need 15 more levels before we can check out that new Kaiju. And right now, guess what? I'm dead. Oh, hold up. Across the way here, I see a bunch of kaiju standing. So let's go ahead and try to fight some people. Maybe they just stand still. Okay, Mecha G did not. I'm just throwing hands at everybody, man. Everyone that I see is getting... Oh, no. This is not good. Hold up. Now, we can defeat this guy, though. One more hit. There we go. We got finally a body. But we didn't level up from it, man. I'm still at level 10. Mecha G, please just calm down. Okay, he didn't calm down. He dropped us off. Oh, hold up, guys. I kind of caught this behemoth off guard. He was just chilling right here. Now I'm getting some good damage. The only problem, though, guys, ain't he, he is not strong whatsoever. Like, his moves are doing not even 200 damage to this big, giant beast. So what's about to happen to me if he hits me one more time? Guess what? I'm dead. All right, guys. Well, at the bottom right, you can see we're at level 15 right now. And for some reason, these guys aren't even fighting back. They're just letting me go to work. So I'm just going to keep doing it. As you guys know, we need about 10 more levels. We need level 25 with this character. And then we can get that beautiful SP version. So I'm going to go to work, guys. I'll be right back. Eventually. All right, guys, I've been hitting everybody in this game for a solid probably hour by now, but we are there. As you can see in the bottom right, we are so close to level 25. If I can just get a few hits in on this spider right here. We just did it, guys. Level 25. And now I just typed in the chat, destroy me now. Everybody is about to destroy me. And just like that, Mangy's dead. But somebody who is very much alive. Let's go ahead and type in singular. Well, there he is. As you can see, his damage already doing a lot more than the regular one. So let's jump right in here and check him out. First of all, guys. He looks absolutely amazing. I mean, even his walk, his mouth, you can see those giant teeth. I already like this character and his moves at the bottom. They all look really cool. Let's go ahead and test some of them out. We've got the binding valve, which is the one move. Oh, okay. A big jump. And we've got shell shock, the number two move. Let's go ahead and check. The oh my gosh. We just destroyed a whole bunch of trees. What about the savage aguire? Let's go ahead and try that real quick. Oh my goodness. It was a giant stomp. Then number four over here, we got the ravaging wallop. What a name, by the... Oh, hold up. I'm sideways stepping. 
And then what was that? I'm gonna need to do some of these moves on some kaijus, but for right now, let's go ahead and hit that roar. This is the first roar. Okay, I mean, that sounds really good. But what about the extinction rise? That thing even sounds amazing. Ooh, okay. And not too good. But at the same time, you know, not too bad. What about the archetype guard? I think that's the move where his scales glow or something. Uh oh, there we go. They're glowing. And I think we can walk around like that too. Yeah, this move is very beautiful. And I think this also means that people can't even hit me. You can see the guard time. It's counting down from 15. And I think you have a total of like 30 seconds to be guarded. So I don't think anybody can hit me right now. As you can see, we got Monster Zero hovering right above me. He's not swinging. I also just noticed that you can't hit anybody either if you're guarding. So now let's go ahead and throw some hands. I've got everybody right here in front of me. I'm just trying to fight. We are testing that new SP Ang right now, and I think he's a lot stronger than the regular. I actually know for a fact he's a lot stronger. That other one was so weak. That took me a whole hour to get him to level 25, and just like that, we dropped off the big spider. And look at Mecha G right here. He said, ah, yeah, you better be running. Let's go ahead and start throwing some more hands, guys, or I don't even know if they're hands. I'm throwing some scales at, at this point. Um, we're, we're dead. That's all right. I wanted to see him by himself anyways. Guys, check out this massive walk. My boy looking like a complete and utter savage just walking around the map. What about his swim, though? You know, they be doing some weird swims sometimes. Okay, I mean, this one, it doesn't look too weird. It kind of just looks normal, right? You know, he's just doing a little doggy paddle, trying to make it through these waters, even though we do have somebody chasing me right now. What are you doing over here, guy? Again, I had to bite him one good time and let him know we ain't playing around. Let's go ahead and get back up on land. Who else wants to fight? I, I do want to try that archetype guard. I want to see if people can actually hit me or not. What I am going to do is go ahead and start throwing some hands or some scales. You already know what I'm talking about. Now, I'm gonna hit the archetype guard real quick, and you can see we have about 2,700 health at the moment. Let's see if we can get hit. We've got Thermo Godzilla bouncing around us. Okay, we are getting hit a little bit, and now we're getting hit by an entire Thermo Pulse, but guys, it did do a lot of damage. You can see, okay, our health is decreasing right now, but it just went back up for some reason. So, the archetype guard is definitely keeping us alive. I think we would have died to that Thermo Pulse. And now, it's about time to get back to battling. Come over here, Thermo G. Can S SP Ang defeat a Thermo Godzilla. Oh, he did it. But we got hit with the Thermo Pulse. How'd that happen? Ooh, we have him at level five, though. Let's go ahead and increase that damage a little bit and spawn right back into Tokyo for some more damage. And don't we have to destroy like 150 buildings? I'm pretty sure that this character right here can do that. I don't think Angie could have done it by himself, but the SP version, I mean, look at that. I am just chomping up some buildings. Every time I pounce, check this out. I'm just gonna hit that pounce move. There goes a few buildings. So yeah, if you have this character and you're trying to clear some buildings, you'll be able to do it pretty fast. Let me check out these buildings buildings in front of me once again. You could see them. Well, now you don't see them anymore. So I think that's what we're going to do for a minute. We're just going to absolutely terrorize this city, doing a few missions. I mean, what about this giant building right here? We got a big building in front of us, and, and now it's gone. Oh, I see you, SP. He is just absolutely terrorizing this city over here. RIP to everybody who lives here, man. It wasn't my decision to make. It was all angst. I am about to start fighting again, though. What's up, Millennium Goji? How you doing, man? Who do you think's going to win this fight? Millennium Gojira, or do you think... Oh, great. I got hit with the thermal pole. Every video, man. Every time I play this game, one more hit. There we go. We defeated Millennium G. But Thermo G, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, we're not gonna defeat him. Does the charge on this character, like, not ever go down? Because I feel like I've been doing the same move over and over. Okay, well, now I'm not, because I'm dead. We are now entering the Arctic, guys. You already know where the tree is. I'm pretty sure it's on top of that hill, right? Now, the real question is, can my boy SP Ang get all the way to the top? If you remember from the last time we did this with Godzilla Jr., he did end up making it all the way to the top. But can my boy SP Ang do it. Oh, my boy just floated up the mountain. I see you, man. He is an entire rock climber. Boy, we hit the top easily. But also, guys, if you do remember from the Godzilla Jr. video, when he fell off, the whole world exploded. So I wonder what happens if my boy SP Ang decides to jump off. You know what? We're gonna do it! Oh, uh, nothing happened? Oh, okay. You know what? That's more like it. You know what, guys? That's the end of this video. And Guaris destroyed the world, and, well, we can't do the next mission now. Other than that, I will see you on tomorrow's video. Thank you for watching. I love ya. Goodbye.